What's up guys, Mardi Gras Man 23 here and it is time for a Lego haul. This haul is a Lego clearance haul from my Walmart and another Walmart that's kind of close to me. This is my biggest ever Lego haul from my Bricklink store. So I went into my Walmart on Friday and they had a, they were starting to move all the toys to this clearance table, but not the Lego. So I asked the lady, she said the Lego was on, she actually scanned one of the Lego advent calendars for me. She said it was on a corporate deal, uh, which means that they didn't mark it down. It can't, had to, they couldn't mark it down. It had to come from corporate. So she couldn't mark down the advent calendar for me. So that was on Friday. So I just happened to go back in there on Monday. And all the Lego was on the clearance table with yellow stickers on it. And it looked a little, little, some of the prices looked a little off. So I scanned one or two items and boy, did I get some deals. So then today on my lunch, I went to another Walmart. They, they had some of the same sets, but not at the same prices. But I did find a few more there. So I'm going to have to, this all will not fit on the table. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on the table and then... Probably try to do one set at a time, I guess. So we did get some smalls. We picked these up at the uh, the one today. So we got this is set 60279. You see it says 748, but the price was actually 299. And I wouldn't have bought these, but they have a really good part out value for some reason. So that's why I picked them up. There was some there was a different one at my Walmart that's 299 that I just left there because it's a different set. Um, and the part out by wasn't as good, so spent a lot of money, so I decided to leave that one there. Then we got this one. This is uh, two, uh, 60285, the um, sports car. This one was marked under $2. It was like two twenty five dollars or something. So I didn't even check the part out value on this. I just bought all four of them. So we got those. Let's see what else we can fit on the table. Picked up one of these. This was, uh, it was like four something. It was less than $5. I had just parted these out the other day. So I'm probably just going to put this one in my investment box. Because I'm not going to part out another one. I just parted this one out. So we got one of those. Uh, let's keep going. This one was $7.48 I believe. This is a 60272. So we got one two, three, we got four of those, you can see that, all right, let me clear the table and we'll show you the next round, okay, so the, I actually passed on these at my, at mine, they were $14.50, they have a good part out value, but when I got to the one uh, down the street, this one was like $6, this is uh, 387 pieces, 43112. Now we know video, video yo, whatever it is, is a bad theme. This has a really good part out. So I, I picked those two up, of course, for six bucks, but that made me go back to mine on the way home today. And these were 14 and some change. So I went ahead and picked them up. That way I have more to part out. So that's, that'll give me four of them. Let's see, we got five, six, seven. So we got seven of those. It's going to get better. Well, let me add, let me show you these two. These two I got because they were three bucks. Four, three, one, eight, nine. They were three dollars. Didn't really want them. They have some crazy part out value of like 20 bucks. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's that big book piece. Or if it's the mini dolls. But for $3, I went ahead and picked them up because of the part out value. But I only got two of those. So let me clear the table again. All right. So where we'll go next is these. This one was the same thing. $7.48. This one has a pretty good part out. And that's what I was looking for. But at, basically at these prices, just about everything has a pretty good part out. I mean, you always want to have be at three times or better. Some of these are five and six and seven times we got four of those 
And then the next one we got was this one. This one has another good part out. This one is 71380. 366 pieces. You see the price on there is $36. This one scanned 10 bucks. So if you're in your Walmarts, make sure you have the app. And there's actually... It's a little tricky to find now, but you can still scan and check prices. And make sure you check the prices because not everything is as it seems. So we got five of those. So that's gonna be a really good one to part out. 468 pieces for 10 bucks. Um, good part out on this one. Okay, so when I saw this one, I knew that this one was going to be a good price. I may already have one of these. This is a 41682, the city school. It was $10, it was maybe $12. It was either $10 or $12. So even though they only had one, I picked that up and I'll just, I don't know, maybe one day I'll part it out. I mean, there's some good window pieces there, some good masonry brick pieces there, but I'll probably just keep this one for the collection. You know, one day maybe sell it as a sealed set. Who knows? We got that one, and then this is one of the bigger sets. This is uh, 71369 Bowser's Castle. 1,000 pieces. The regular price on this was $100. You see it says $74.96. It scanned 30 bucks. Now, I did see some more of these in the, my other Walmart, but they scanned 60 something dollars. 68 I believe. This was the one that, this is kind of what first I decided. There's three of them. There's four of them. And we got one more. There's five of them. This, is, this was the set that I was like, well, I guess I'm just going to go all in. So we got that. So we got five of those. But we got one more set. This one has an extremely ridiculous part out value. I think the part out value on this one is like 200 bucks so that was really good really glad we that's why I, i'm going to go back to my other one on probably monday which give it a weekend and if they sell they sell if not i'm going to probably add whatever they have because that's going to be a big part out and then they had this one this one is the friends city hotel 1300 pieces Regular price was $99.99. Again, it says $74.98. It scanned 30 bucks. So we got all those. So that's it. That's a heck of a haul. Let me see if I can make one big old pile. Also pick this one up. I've been wanting this set for a long time. This was $11. Well, it might have been $11.20 or something, but... Been wanting this one for a long time. I have the set that it goes with. Two sets from my collection are that Avengers Iron Man set and possibly that schoolhouse. So that is a large, tall stack of Lego for the Bricklink store. If you guys find anything, I will tell you, don't be discouraged. Check your Walmarts because now is the time. Um, everyone in my area is doing the resets right now. So... Over the weekend, everything's getting moved off the aisle. Um, don't be discouraged by the yellow stickers. Scan everything. You never know. Half of, I, half of the stuff I scanned was cheaper than the, the yellow stickers. There's actually still some advent calendars there. There's some more video, video yo sets there. Uh, my other Walmart still has some of those Bowsers. They, they have uh, some of the Childs. So if those go deeper, I'm definitely going to pick them up. So that's it for this one, guys. Just a big stack of Lego. You guys finding anything? You know, I heard there wasn't anything anywhere. No clearance. And then all of a sudden, bam, look at all this. All right, guys. Really appreciate all the support. Thanks for watching. Check us out on the A-Fool podcast. And until the next one, we'll see you again. <laughs>